Then we have a castle nut. These are typically used in cars. You'll find them on axles when they hold on wheels and bearings, um, rotors. And we're going to demonstrate this one also for you, whereas we're going to um, drill out a bolt, slide the cotta pin in to show you how this is locked in place. Here I have a castle nut, which we're going to drill a hole for this cotta pin to go through the, cut, the castle nut. I am going to in where these little grooves are in the castle nut I'm going to set myself a little starter I'm going to take my drill so this is one eighth this cotta pin is one eighth of an inch in diameter. I'm going to drill a three sixteenths hole. What's key here is that you hold the drill level. So when you come out the other side, that you come out right where the exit through that prong. And of course, I need to add some lubricant. Make sure my bit lasts me for a while. And I'm drilling stainless steel here. And I'm eyeing straight across as I'm drilling this I'm mining straight across the screw to make sure I'm running in the right direction in most cases in most cases um, this holes there for you already and you don't have to drill it, but in some situations you may have to do that. So I'm sliding that through. There's your cotta pin. I'm gonna grab a little pliers here. I'm gonna bend this around to lock, to lock this in place. So make sure that your uh, your wheels don't pop off if it's going on your car. This is your protection of that. And then that's not going anywhere. It's locked in place. And that's the whole mechanism behind a castle nut. There you go. Subscribe, like, comment. Visit us at albanycountyfasteners.com for 50,000 SKUs right off the rack, ready to ship. We look forward to seeing you in our next video.